everyone, Joel Anson Tim in Rochester Hills, Michigan, which is Detroit area nonetheless. Outside, Naked Burger, guys. Naked Burger. Yes, we're here at their new location. They have two locations. One's in Clinton Township. One is here in Rochester Hills. Here doing their giant Naked Burger challenge, guys. And this is a big one. We're talking probably about nine, maybe even ten pounds of food. Uh, no features a whole bunch of their burgers. We got, I think, a chicken sandwich or two. We have a fish sandwich. Um, then we have a whole bunch of their fries. They're, like, known for truffle fries. Truffle burgers as well. I love, love, love truffle. And I believe some matzo sticks. Maybe even some chicken wings. Um, I'm going to give you the exact details. Um, I do know we're going to 40 minutes to complete the challenge but this is also a very 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 high risk high stakes challenge so these are like gourmet burgers and if we fail we're going to be looking at about a 200 dollar price tag otherwise the meal is going to be free so 200 dollar burger challenge let's head on in let's have some piece of food and uh i'll get you some more info let's go eat all right, everyone, so we're here with all the food. It looks absolutely fantastic. I am so pumped. This smells great, looks great. Um, so we have a whole bunch of the burgers, again, everything. So what we have, we have the Naked Burger. This is the standard burger. Simplicity, simplicity at its best. Try saying that five times. We have the Diablo Burger. So this is a spicy burger. I have the Off the Hook. This is a fish sandwich. I have the Hangover Burger, which is a fried egg, candy bacon. You know I love both of those. I have their truffle fries, truffle parm fries, guys. I love, 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 love truffle. But these are huge servings. My French fries. I have the feta oregano fries here. I have what I am so excited for, the black truffle burger, guys. This is shaved truffle on that, so I'm super excited. I have an order of their smoked wings. And then we have this absolutely crazy chicken sandwich called the Chick Magnet. Like your magnet. Chick Magnet. Look at that. That's actually a chicken sandwich. There's just that much macaroni and cheese on it. You can barely even tell. And then an order of their absolutely famous matzo sticks. So these are a handmade matzo stick, hand breaded. Oh, look at this. Look at this cheese pulliness. This is what they told me about. They're just known for that crazy cheese pull. So there we go. We saw it in first hand. So yeah, we're gonna have 40 minutes to complete the challenge. I'm definitely excited. Uh, it looks delicious. And the value of this, we're sitting at almost 200 bucks. So let's hopefully uh, get through this, but I'm so excited to dive on in. I have a couple of their house-made sauces, like their Chipotle ketchup, you know I'm about that ketchup. Um, the different aiolis, they make everything here. So yeah, that's about that. So let's get started here, just momentarily. Everyone, so I'm excited, let's get started. Do I know where to start? Absolutely not. How about I start with this truffle burger? I am well, well, well looking forward to this thing, guys. I love truffle, truffle's my absolute favorite. So I am ready, restaurant is ready, cool. So how about we get started? We'll say the count of five, four, three, two, one, let us eat. Holy cow, no pun intended. Mm. Oh my beef. Mmm, 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 mmm. That char grilled burger, oh my god. Mmm. Oh my god. Mmm. Wow. Everybody. Oh my god. That truffle burger is everything I imagined. Hey everyone, welcome to this video. Today we're here at Naked Burger in Rochester Hills, Michigan, taking on this absolutely giant burger challenge. So we kind of went through the food we have in front of us, but as you see, a large variety of their different burgers. We also have a big fried chicken sandwich. We got multiple orders of fries. We have their signature smoked wings. There was just so, so, so much food. So this place definitely emphasizes quality. It definitely emphasizes gourmet burgers, gourmet bites. And that is exactly what we received. All right, guys, that was fantastic. That is like, wow. Wow, wow, wow. All right, let's keep going. Let's try this chicken sandwich here. This is actually a grilled chicken sandwich, but holy crap. All right. I was excited for that truffle burger, and they did it well. They did it well. 
So every bite was just an absolute explosion of flavor. I literally had a hard time just actually like focusing, you know, to get through this food as it was so enjoyable. I just wanted to like with every bite take my time, with every bite savor it because it was absolutely awesome. Um, so the burgers were all cooked perfectly. Um, the interesting notes of, you know, having like a fish sandwich and a chicken sandwich I thought was very well played out and it had very complimentary ingredients and flavors on all of the burgers so you know if you had like a, a you know a rich burger you're getting like some jalapenos on there if you had the rich uh, you know truffles you had kind of a crisp cheese or something to kind of just add a different dynamic on um, the uh, fish sandwich we had um, you know a really unique slaw um, the chicken sandwich, well, the chicken sandwich is just pure over-the-top gluttony, let's be honest. But in the best way possible, look at all that mac and cheese. The fries as well, I mean, pretty standard, you know, in the sense of like a truffle and parm. But that is just, it is just amazing. Like, simplicity that's best. Also, the sauces, oh man. Fantastic. Another thing I have to give the credit to, I ordered my burger cooked like medium, and it was cooked perfectly. So, let's grab the naked burger. So in this we got some naked sauce. Nothing wrong with, you know, a little nakedness, I guess you could say. And why it's called naked? Simplicity at its best, guys. Simplicity at its best. So, I'm excited to try this. This looks fantastic. Mmm. Oh, wow. Mm. That's delicious. Look at that. That naked sauce is a great, great, great flavor. We did have 40 minutes to complete the challenge, and I knew we were definitely going to need it just with the absolute extreme amount of food in front of us. Um, and definitely there is a, it carried quite a price tag, I will say that, but like I said, for the quality, the ingredients, and what you are getting, it is well, well, well worth it. Um, so with that, everyone, I believe that's pretty much the majority of the info I have for you today. Uh, comment down below if you would like a bite. Yes, give me a hashtag bite, give me a hashtag no. So with that, let's get to the rest of the video, and ultimately, let's see what happens. All right, we're roughly four minutes in. Guys. Like, I think this is maybe the Chipotle ketchup. I want to try because I love Chipotle. I'm talking about... Mm. Oh, man. Guys. Mmm. Mmm. Game changer. Pretty spicy, though, but... Woo! Ketchup has just been unmatched, guys. Ketchup has been one-upped. Chipotle ketchup, naked burger. I would probably drink that by the gallon. Maybe we can arrange a, I'll buy a few bottles before I leave. I seriously would, that was delicious. Another challenge, there we go guys, drink a gallon of ketchup. Let's try this uh, off the hook. This is the fish burger, so we got a lovely cod on here. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Ooh. Excuse me. Ooh, compliments to the chef and a lot of cultures, so please take that as that. All right. Now this just like, I can tell. It is very good. What do I expect? Yes, I would recommend. Mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. Boy, oh boy. It just keeps getting better. I didn't even know it could. Alrighty, oh my gosh. Wow. We have lots of fries, lots of wings, a couple burgers, that monstrous Freaking chicken sandwich. That is, uh, that is, uh, what is a heck of a chicken sandwich, I gotta say. Looks fantastic. And then the matzo sticks. I'm gonna dive into this probably, uh, 
Maybe the hangover burger. Guys, this has a lovely looking runny yolk on it. I'm a big egg on burger person. Let me know down below if you're an egg on burger person. Hashtag diehard egg on burger. So let's give this a go, guys. And candied bacon. This is gonna be like a, this is gonna be a bite. I'm gonna, this, watch this run. Oh my god. Mm. That bacon. I got that, that runny egg on there. Mm -hmm. Oh man. We got avocado on here too? Oh my gosh. Mm. Amazing. Amazing, amazing. Mm. Oh my god. Careless whisper moment. Holy crap. Guys, this is life changing. Holy jump it. Oh my God. I literally think this is the best burger of the year. I'm making an official statement. Official statement, guys. Best burger of the year. Holy crap. So rich, so savory. I'm making a word for this. And like I said, that burger of the year. Holy crap. Fantastic. Alrighty. And we're 10 minutes in. Whew. A lot of food, guys, but I am so enjoying this. This is so fantastic. Like, yeah, this is, you're in those Detroit suburbs. This is where you gotta be. Two locations, this is the new one. Rochester Hills. Holy crap, though, guys, that was such a good burger. All right, back to eating. What am I doing? I like, I've just lost what I was doing in my life. Diablo Burger. So this one is supposed to be quite spicy, so we got some, like, tortilla chips, looks like. Oh, yeah, okay. Crunchy, crunchy. Let's give this a go. Jalapenos. Ghost pepper cheese. Onions in that guac. A lot of richness in this burger, but that spice kind of counteracts it. Delicious. Very, very delicious. Mm. Alrighty. We got the chick magnet. Now this one, I'm gonna have to fork and knife this a bit. Because I don't think there's any way I can anybody can take a bite of that. I have a big mouth. I take big bites. Are the bites as big in person as they are on the on, on, online or they're definitely bigger. They're they're <laughs> the bites are bigger in person. Like I said guys, and I don't think I can well, all right, now I gotta try, just basically say I could say. Whatever, let's try if I can bite this. Oh, well, I, you have a lot, oh my, well, you have a lot more confidence in me than I do, look at that. All right, guys, let's bite this magnet. Almost, I barely touched the bunch. Holy crap, whoa. Talk about rich and creamy, wow. That is a that is a creamy, creamy pizza fried chicken. Wow, I'm, that's honestly I didn't really know what to expect, but that's a win. Got some nice coleslaw on there as well. Right, guys and we are coming on 14 minutes man this is like this is just too 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 good all right i'm putting some chipotle on that uh chicken sandwich
Hefty though. Oh. Oh. Probably a good idea. Lots of fries, lots of sticks, and some wings. Let us rock into, try these wings. So this is like a Korean flavor, it's like a chili paste on it. And they do smoke the wings. Definitely not hungry. I'm very, very satiated. This was an astounding meal. And uh, I gotta give a shot of those burgers. You don't need more than one to fill you up. I'll tell you that much. I like the smoke on this. Really interesting flavor. Twenty minutes in, guys. All right, we're down to lots and lots of fries, and then the matcha sticks. Whew. Fed out of Ragnar, everybody. Nice flavor combo. I'm just gonna use my hand. I was gonna fork it, but it's just gonna take too long. Truffle parm fries. Woo! A lot of food, everybody. A lot of food. I know there's some truffle aioli here as well. Let's see, put the real truffle in. I do like me some truffles. Looks really good. Mm. Oh man. That is truffle. I gotta say, guys, that is an excellent flavor. Thank you. Ooh. Great pair. You ever decide to put truffle on things? Good on you. I've got about a truffle aioli, let's give this a try. I'm probably about 28 minutes in. A lot of food, guys. Whew. 
We're fantastic. I've been so impressed with it. Give us a go though. Oh my god. Woo -hoo -hoo. Holy crap. Talk about a mouthful of flavor. Oh man. Another sauce that would buy by the gallon. If you start selling it by the gallon, I just want like a 10% royalty. It's okay. <laughs> All right guys, a bit over 30 minutes in. Woo, a lot of food. Mm. Those portions of fries were giant. Love truffle on that though, loved it. Loved the truffle aioli as well. Super rich. Just these mozza sticks. I've done a lot of talking, so <coughs> wasted some time, but hopefully we'll still get this win here. Hamburg and Monster Sticks, these things went viral. Super, super popular. That is some cheesy Monster Sticks. Woo! Lots of pulley. Wow. I have never had a Monster Stick like that before. Super light, fluffy, airy. This is a huge too, by the way. Great cheese. And we are finished. Holy jumpers, guys. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Well, I gotta say, that was a lot of food, but man, that was dang good. I absolutely loved, 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 loved. Man, those burgers. I mean, it's called Naked Burger. It is named at like, you know, the burger is in the name, but they really, really know how to make some good burgers. I like that hangover burger was life-changing. The truffle burger was absolutely delicious. Um, the chicken sandwich actually was like far exceeded anything could have imagined. It was still so crispy, great flavor with all that mac, which just provided like a super richness. Um, the coleslaw on there, the off the hook was fantastic. The fries were really nice. The uh, truffle aioli, again, I would buy it by the gallon. That stuff is rich, delicious, and truffly. I think that's a word. Um, but yeah, everybody, so huge thanks everybody here at Naked Burger. For that, we are going to give the meal for free, um, but that was fantastic. I would definitely, definitely recommend coming on by. Great place for an evening out, great place for a lunch, a dinner. Um, I can't say enough. Like I said, definitely try one of those burgers. Uh, grab yourself maybe some truffle fries, and they do have a large variety of cocktails, I know. Now, I'm going to be driving and stuff, so I'm not really going to drink, whatever, but they insisted that they give me like a cocktail or two to try. So I will at least give it a try because if they're anywhere, anywhere 
as amazing as those burgers were, I know we are in for a hell of a treat. So I'll maybe see that. Who knows, maybe we have a little dessert in the works, I'm not sure. But uh, at that, yeah, so we get a meal free of school. Um, and that's about that. So yeah, I don't, let's do all the final time on screen. That was a lot of food. That took me a lot longer than I anticipated, but I was enjoying myself way, 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 like a lot. We'll put it that way. So with that everybody, we'll be back here just momentarily. All right, so let's just say we got a lot more than I bargained for. Um, hey, but they basically gave me all like wide variety of their specialty cocktails to try. Again, I am not drinking all these, everybody. I am just gonna try them because I will. And this, this, oh my gosh, look at this fantastic looking thing. This is an espresso honey truffle cheesecake. I love truffle. They said, if you love truffle, this is for you. And here we are. So I am pumped to try that. Let's try these cocktails first. So, what do we got in front of me here? Botanical garden, agave, mint, campari, lemon lime. Very, very, very fresh. Actually, very delicate. You definitely get a little bit of that campari, kind of that little like pucker sourness, but very good. That mint keeps it very, very fresh, tones it down. All right, what do we got here? You know what this smells like? It smells like Christmas. It's Christmas! All right, cool guys. Well, let's give that a give that a sip. Oh my gosh! That is like, I almost want to call it like a rum and eggnog with pineapple. I like that a lot. Good dehydrated pineapple as well. I'm gonna to attempt to eat it. It tastes like pineapple. All right, what do we have here? Zombie glyph. I'm sorry, what's in it? Ginger beer. Really, let's try to stir this one up. Got a nice separation of colors there. Let's see. Ooh, that is zip, zangy, zippy. You have to get that like strawberry, but you get that like pucker of that mm, ginger beer. You know what I'm saying? That that ginger beer pucker. All right, what we got here? Pink Panther. Oh, you definitely get that guava. A little bit of rosemary hint. I like it. It's uh, yeah, the guava. Guava is really nice. Guava is a cool flavor. If you're familiar with guava, let me know down below. What we got going here? Lavender berry mojito. Lavender. Rum, lavender blueberry mint and lime. Lavender berry mojito. All right, let's give this a go. That mint from that mojito. Subtle note of lavender. A little bit of berryness I can. Cast away. Bourbon, black rum, cola, pineapple, lemon. Okay, let's give this a go. Definitely get that bourbon. They said there's rum, lemon in there. That's kind of like a, if you like a whiskey sour slash old fashioned or something, I think you're really gonna like that. So, cool. Well, thank you for showing me these cocktails. I am going to politely move them to the side. They are very fantastic, don't get me wrong. The generosity is bar none. But now it is time for dessert. So let us give this delicious looking cheesecake a go. I am pumped. All right guys, espresso honey truffle. Oh, that is a thick, thick looking bottom crust there. That is a light, delicate cheesecake. Oh man. The richness in that, there's such a strong, there's, at first there's a strong truffle note, but now my palate is just being coated with like cream, cheese, cheesecake, espresso flavors. Wow, just wow. Very, very rich. You could definitely share this piece with a few people. Naked Burger, I definitely recommend. Great spot, great people, great food. So that everybody, until next time. I guess I definitely come on by, try some items, just not all at once. You don't need to eat as many as I do in one sitting. But I would definitely recommend trying everything. So of course, until next time, say happy, healthy, hungry, happy eating. And uh, that's about it. Appreciate you guys, and that.
Have a lovely day. Hey, guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And at that, thank you so much, you rock.